What's going on everyone? It's Kyle here from Colossus Fitness here to do one of the best chest, shoulder, and tricep body weight exercises. If you do have access to dumbbells, these are great. If not, let's bring up the reps and show you how to do proper form because a lot of times people do it improperly. So this is an amazing movement. You're gonna wanna find something kind of like this if you have access to a gym or a park. These are tremendous. When it comes down to it, I'm just gonna give you a bunch of different reps and show you proper form. A chest dip essentially is when you're angled forward, right? So you pretty much wanna just allow yourself at the very first part of the movement to tip forward, okay? Tip forward and bring your arms down to about a 90 degree angle, okay? Just like this. I'm gonna show you a bunch of reps. Tip forward, up, forward, up, okay? Nice and controlled, boom. One of the best exercises, I just did four to five reps and I'm already feeling it. If you do have access to a weight belt, one of the best movements is to put some weight down below or you can have someone put a dumbbell in between your legs, which we'll show you on the screen, which is an amazing exercise. But here's four common mistakes that take place where a lot of people do get injured and I just wanna show you them so you don't get hurt. The number one common mistake, way too much momentum and lockout. A lot of times people treat this as like a super power exercise, like just walking out like crazy, just busting them out like this. From a couple reps, my shoulders and elbows already hurt. Avoid doing that. Make sure that it's nice and controlled, okay? Number two common mistake is kipping, okay? A lot of times, so for me personally, I like taking my legs and putting them back here just to ensure that I'm not gonna kip. And a lot of times people, because this is a tougher movement for quite a few people, they'll, they'll kind of allow themselves to use a bit more momentum, bring their knees forward a little bit. It kind of looks a bit awkward, but I see this happen very often. And this is just gonna take the tension off of the chest and turn into not an actual chest dip. Number three common mistake, probably one of the most important is actually not retracting your scapulas. Pretty much you wanna pull your shoulder blades back. Like at the very start of the movement, once I jump up here, the first thing I'm gonna do is just pull my shoulder blades back and get into position. A lot of times people are just too loose and they're too upright, which going into number four common mistake is being way too upright. Now, tricep dips are good. You're gonna be a little bit more upright, but people make it way too uncomfortable. They're trying to say way too straight up and right here, this is an uncomfortable position that's gonna put way too much strain on your shoulders. So once again, for this chest dip especially and just proper shoulder health, you wanna make sure that you get a nice lean forward, you got a nice full range of motion. One other common mistake, number five, is people go way too low. Down here puts way too much strain. We wanna make sure that this is an optimal exercise to help benefit us in other ways and not get us injured and not have us just have really poor and crappy shoulders. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click that first link in the description, 50 plus form exercises in the gym. And you guys will love every single one. If you ever wanna take your fitness journey to the next level with the best programming ever, hit the sec second link in the description. We'll take care of you and we'll see you in the next video. Peace out.